Sub nerds, I am Jeebus Platinum. This is Mass Effect, and in the previous video, we created our class, prepared all the backstory, and everything is ready to go. I'm extremely excited about this series. Um, I've got all three games, and it's going to be a blast playing through them. So let's dive in. Well, what about Shepard? Earthborn, but no record of his family. Doesn't have one. He was raised on the streets. Learned to look out for himself. He proved himself during the Blitz. Held off enemy forces on the ground until reinforcements arrived. He's the only reason Elysium is still standing. We can't question his courage. Humanity needs a hero. And Shepard's the best we've got. I'll make the call. In the year 2148, explorers on Mars discovered the remains of an ancient spacefaring civilization. In the decades that followed, these mysterious artifacts revealed startling new technologies, enabling travel to the furthest stars. The basis for this incredible technology was a force that controlled the very fabric of space and time. They called it the greatest discovery in human history. The civilizations of the galaxy call it Mass Effect. Awesome. Terrace Prime relays in range, initiating transmission sequence. Commander. We are connected. Calculating transit mass and destination. The relay is hot, acquiring approach vector. All stations secure for transit. Thrusters, check. Navigation, check. Internal emissions sync engaged. All systems online. Drift, just under 1500k. 1500 is good. Your captain will be pleased. I hate that guy. Nihilus gave you a compliment. So you hate him. You remember to zip up your jumpsuit on the way out of the bathroom? That's good. I just jumped us halfway across the galaxy and hit a target the size of a pinhead. So that's incredible. Besides, specters are trouble. I don't like having them on board. Call me paranoid. You're paranoid. The Council helped fund this project. They have a right to send someone to keep an eye on their investment. Yeah, that is the official story. But only an idiot believes the official story. He seems to have some issues with authority. But I agree with him. Only an idiot believes the official story. They don't send specters on shakedown runs. So there's more going on here than the captain's letting up. Joker, status report. Just cleared the mass relay, Captain. Stealth systems engaged. Everything looks solid. Good. Find a comm buoy and link us into the network. I want mission reports relayed back to Alliance Brass before we reach Eden Prime. Aye, aye, Captain. Better brace yourself, sir. I think Nihilus is headed your way. He's already here, Lieutenant. Tell Commander Shepard to meet me Good in the one. calm room for a debriefing. You get that, Commander? Yep. I got it. I'm on my way. <laughs> is it me or does the captain always sound a little pissed off? Only when he's talking to you, Joker. Okay, so we're headed to the captain. Uh, Joker is not a fan of no, Nihilus, who seems to be an permission. agent of the Council. So I'm not really sure what that means, but we will find out. Congratulations, Commander. Looks like we had a smooth run. You heading down to see the captain? I am. He asked for me specifically. I'm on my way to give him a status update right now. With all due respect, sir, maybe he'll finally tell you what we're really doing out here. Oh, I'll look into it. Don't you worry. I'll see if I can get some answers when I see him. Good luck, Commander. Thanks, bud. 
I grew up on Eden Prime, Doc. Eden Prime. Not That's apparently where we're headed bitten. as well. There's something Nihilus isn't telling us about this mission. Something Nihilus That's isn't crazy. telling us. The captain's in charge. Humans apparently don't trust uh, this Nihilus guy a whole lot. I think that's his name, Nihilus. I'm not sure what his name is. Commander Shepard, I was hoping you'd get here first. It will give us a chance to talk. Talk, you say? What about? I'm interested in this world we're going to, Eden Prime. I've heard it's quite beautiful. I've heard not very little about it. I've never been there. But you know of it. It's become something of a symbol for your people, hasn't it? Proof that humanity can not only establish colonies across the galaxy, but also protect them. But how safe is it really? How safe is it really? Huh. If you've got something to say, just say it. Your people are still newcomers, Shepard. The galaxy can be a very dangerous place. Is the Alliance truly ready for this? I think it's about time we told the Commander what's really going on. This mission is far more than a simple shakedown run. What? Surprise. What's going on? Is someone gonna fill me in, Captain? We're making a covert pickup on Eden Prime. That's why we needed the stealth systems operational. Covert pickup. What's the payload, Captain? A research team on Eden Prime unearthed some kind of beacon during an excavation. It was Prothean. Prothean, that sounds cool. I thought the Protheans vanished 50,000 years ago. Their legacy still remains. The mass relays, the citadel, our ship drives. It's all based on Prothean technology. This is big, Shepard. The last time humanity made a discovery like this, it jumped our technology forward 200 years. Hmm. But Eden Prime doesn't have the facilities to handle something like this. We need to bring the beacon back to the citadel for proper study. Obviously, this goes beyond mere human interests, Commander. This discovery could affect every species in Council space. Dude's face is kind of weird. But Prothean Discovery is apparently a civilization with some crazy technology that could be really helpful in whatever it is we're doing. So I don't need your help. No, I do. I feel like, uh, actually, I have no idea. It never hurts Hopefully to have a few we extra can hands with Nihilus over. further down the road. The beacon's not the only reason I'm here, Shepard. Nihilus wants to see you in action, Commander. He's here to evaluate you. <laughs> Kelly is. <laughs> That's funny. Um, Nihilus is here to evaluate me. Why? What's going on, Captain? The Alliance has been pushing for this for a long time. Humanity wants a larger role in shaping interstellar policy. We want more say with the Citadel Council. The Spectres represent the Council's power and authority. If they accept a human into their ranks, it shows how far the Alliance has come. You held off an enemy assault during the Blitz single-handed. You showed not only courage, but also incredible skill. That's why I put your name forward as a candidate for the Spectres. Okay, there's the Council again, and then the Spectre. I guess that's what Nihilus is. Um, the mutant Spectre. Just tell me what I have to do. I need to see your skills for myself, Commander. Eden Prime will be the first of several missions together. You'll be in charge of the ground team. Secure the beacon and get it onto the ship ASAP. Nihilus will accompany you to observe the mission. Alright, let's do it. Just give the word, Captain. We should be getting close to Eden. Captain, we got a problem. What's wrong, Joker? Transmission from Eden Prime, sir. You better see this. Bring it up on screen. Get down! cuts out after that. No comm traffic at all. Just goes dead. There's nothing. Reverse and hold the 38.5. What is that? Status report. 17 minutes out, Captain. No other Alliance ships in the area. Take us in, Joker. Fast and quiet. This mission just got a lot more complicated. A small strike team can move quickly without drawing attention. It's our best chance to secure the beacon. Grab your gear and meet us in the cargo hold. 
Tell Alenko and Jenkins to suit up, Commander. You're going in. Engaging stealth systems. Somebody was doing some serious digging here, Captain. Your team's the muscle in this operation, Commander. Go in heavy and head straight for the dig site. What about survivors, Captain? Helping survivors is a secondary objective. The beacon's your top priority. Approaching drop point one. Nihilus, you're coming with us? I move faster on my own. Nihilus will scout out ahead. He'll feed you status reports throughout the mission. Otherwise, I want radio silence. Got it. Ready and able, sir. The mission's yours now, Shepard. Good luck! We are approaching drop point two. Okay, save point's probably a good time uh, to end this episode. So far, the Council has sent a Spectre named Nihilus to um, not only try to retrieve this Prothean beacon, um, which apparently the Protheans were a civilization that were supposedly wiped out a long time ago, um, but their technology is far superior to that of ours. Um, and I'm also being kind of watched and inspected to see if I would be a good Spectre, which could be apparently a good step forward for humanity um, and the Alliance. So. We didn't really get a whole lot done, but we did learn a lot. Next episode, we will be, I guess, moving towards that beacon, see if we can find that, um, and hopefully get to some, uh, some fights, maybe shoot some stuff. Thanks for watching, guys, and I will see you next time.